In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly integrate Git response with ClickFunnels. Hello, my name is Austin Godbolt, and I create videos to help you escape the cubicle. Be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell if you are looking for different ways to escape the cubicle. And before I forget, if you want to know my number one way to escape the cubicle and start living the life that you deserve, click the first link in the description or go to alstongodbolt.com forward slash start. All right, so as I mentioned in this video, I'm going to show you how to integrate Get response with ClickFunnels. Now I talk a lot on this channel about ClickFunnels because I think it has an incredibly powerful platform. With ClickFunnels, you can do things like send out automated emails, create landing pages, create websites, create membership sites. It's a page builder. There's just a number of things that you can do with it. In addition, you can actually tie together Get response to take it a step further. It, with Get response, as you can see on my screen, it does email marketing, it does marketing automation. You can also create landing pages and an auto funnel. So the next question should be, why would someone combine ClickFunnels and Git Response? To be perfectly honest with you, so if you use Git Response for your backend for things like building your mailing list and sending out autoresponder emails with ClickFunnels, it's going to be cheaper than just using ClickFunnels alone. ClickFunnels is an incredibly powerful platform. Um, it can be a little bit expensive. If you you can help mitigate some of those costs if you integrate if you integrate Git Response. Now, what I'll do is I'll leave a link in the description. It will link to a free 30 day trial for Git response. You'll need Git response obviously to set this up, but let's go ahead and get it started. So click the 30 day free trial in the description. You'll sign up for free. You don't even have to put in a credit card. Once you get to the other side, you verify your account and your name, all that good stuff. You should see a pretty blank or pretty basic dashboard like this uh, to set up or integrate Git response with ClickFunnels. It's actually pretty easy. So what we're going to do is we're going to click menu in the top left hand corner go to integration and API, click API, and we're going to generate a new API key. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this key and we're going to put it into ClickFunnels. And I'll show you how to do that in just a second, but let's call this, uh, we'll call this like click fun test. And we are going to generate a key. So now that we have this key here, click fun test, I would need to copy this key and go on over to ClickFunnels. The next step after you get to ClickFunnels is to hover over your account name and go down to account settings. Once you get to account settings, you're going to click on integrations on the left hand side. When you click on integrations, you are going to click add new integration. And you're simply going to type once you get to available integrations, you're going to type in Git. Git will return Git response. And here we are going to name this whatever we want. We can, I'll just name it um, click, I think I call it click fun test. And we're going to paste in that API key. So if I hit paste and add integration, you will see the green success and you'll also see the um, newest API key here under integrations. Now, I just wanna show you really quickly how this all works. If we go over to our funnels. I am going to I am going to go up to funnels and I'm just going to create a new funnel to kind of show you how all of this works. So I'm going to click on add new and I'm just going to do a create new funnel, collect emails and I'm just going to call this a boring test. Build funnel. And from here I am going to click opt in. I'm just going to choose this first template here. Select template. Now this is where we are actually going to connect our get response to click funnels so that when someone enters their email and wants to join our mailing list, it'll get sent over to click funnels right now. It, they're integrated, but they're not connected. We'll say they're not connected to this website to connect the two. We simply go to settings integrations, and then we are going to select the integration. From here, we are going to choose Git response, click fun test, add to campaign, select, then it will be the mailing list that you set up. So that is really it. You know that it worked because it says connected. If we hover back over here, the integrations is connected and really that's all you have to do. You need a free Git response account, which I will put a link in the description. Obviously you need ClickFunnels if you don't already have ClickFunnels. Uh, there will also be a link in the description for a 14 day free trial. You have to go over when you're in Git response, go up to menu, go to APIs, 
click on API and generate a new API key. You'll copy that key. You will uh, go to the account settings, find integrations, type in Git, and then you're going to add in that API key and a generic name. And then as you saw with this uh, landing page, we go to settings, integration, find the click funnel that you just, or find the Git response that you just added, and then follow the steps. Again, if you wanna know my number one way to escape the cubicle and start living the life that you deserve, click the first link in the description or go to alstongodbolt.com forward slash start. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Before I forget, I do want to inform you that some of the links that you will see in your description are affiliate links and I do and can receive a commission if you click on those links and purchase a product.